initially I was known as the kitsch designer. I was very attracted to things that people will consider useless or just something taken for granted. Images of typical gods or crazy posters from the street. That's how I began and kind of my work was standing out from there on. Once I started showing in London is when the press started writing about how colourful my work is, is when I realised that actually my strong point is colour. When I started showing internationally, I realised that I have to take my country with me. So I started using ideas which were very generic, or taking inspirations like circus or taking inspirations like space, Mars attack, these kind of different themes. But I will actually come to India and make them in the most exquisite embroideries, which probably I could say today also nobody else in the world can do embroideries like we would do in India. That kind of set me apart and then people started taking note of me. There I was using the talent of India, but in a vision which was understood by everybody. I was not just which is the case with a lot of Indian designers that they would use Indian techniques but they will as well use Indian history for, for inspiration which becomes very ethnic in the end and that's what doesn't work uh, internationally. People want something now, people want something what's happening around you today. Well, sequence is I think something uh, we live with, we don't even think about it as special anymore. You know, I, our office sequence is considered like a most common ingredient of uh, embroidery. And now, after using it so much, the people who do it, the craftsmen, they have mastered it so much that a lot of times, if you don't see it closely, it looks as good as the printed version. It, it's as precise. It's part of my first collection, the butterfly dress from my Paris show. And that dress, I remember, it took us about three and a half to four months to create because each butterfly is hand embroidered. It, it's something that I can say it's become our identity.